we are playing some Grimm's Hollow, and this is a brand new game. I have not ever played this game, but I always wanted to because uh, the art style for it is really cute, and it's an RPG Maker game, so it might be secretly really, really dark. Also, oh wow, the, the hype train just ended. What did I get? <gasps> I got a kitty. I got a kitty. What did you guys get? I got a kitty! <gasps> Doo -doo! Oh my god, it's so cute! Is that a kitty actually? Wait, let me look at that. I don't know if that's a kitty. Oh wait, I think that's a wolf. <laughs> Thank you for the the six bits, PR plays. Alright, let's get going and start this game, everyone. It's it's a break. Oh my god! The PR plays! Thank you for the 18 bits. Oh my god, wait. I got a cool dolphin too. What did you guys get? Share your emotes in chat. I got a cool dolphin. Look at that dude. I could see him on like a, a vaporwave cover. So cute. And you know what else is cute? This game. Look at this. It's adorable. Wait, did I get a cat? <laughs> I got a cat. Oh my god, I got a cat emote! <gasps> I got a cat emote, you guys! It's so cute! Oh, I'm gonna be using these emotes a lot. I like using the squirtle looking one that the Overtaker just posted in chat, so... Ooh. <laughs> Imagine if I bought 500 bits and used them all at once. Oh my god, PR Blaze, you would destroy my computer! <laughs> one moment, oh god! I don't know if I should be happy or scared. I don't think I got anything since I didn't contribute, but I hope everyone's happy with their emotes. Oh, that sucks. Hype, e Hype trains don't give emotes to everyone that's there? That sucks. But congratulations to the people that did get emotes. But anyway, let's play Grimm's Hollow. Let's begin. The art style looks adorable. This game contains some discussions of grief and losing a loved one. Discretion is advised. Suitable for ages 13 and up. Well, everyone here better be at least 13 because you're not allowed to be on Twitch. Otherwise. Alright, let's go. I trained to give emotes to those who gifted subs and bits, but I didn't gift anything. I got gifted stuff. You're negative four. Someone banned this person. He hasn't even been conceived yet. Not for another four years. Might want to brace yourself, Starry. Oh, is it one of the... Oh, wait. Oh, no. I know what you're gonna do. Oh, my God. I'm still here! Holy crap, rip. <laughs> I'm sure it's because you're the streamer. Oh, okay. So I just get emotes for other people's effort? That doesn't seem fair. But anyway, anyway, let's begin. So basic RPG maker controls. Higher focus on turn, easier and fewer fights for story focused players. I ain't a coward. I'm playing on normal. It's recommended to those who have some experience with turn-based combat or prefer more difficult battles. Yeah, you could say I play Devil Survivor on Apocalypse mode. Wake up, Link. Elio, they're getting bits slash subs because they like you. It's your effort to... Ah! Welcome, new reaper. Guys, I think I might be a simp. Well, I'm a shrimp. I'm not actually a shrimp. I'm a bunny. Oh, is it my birthday? We're so happy to have you join us. It's been such a long time since we've seen a new face. What? Oh my god! Wait! 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 <laughs> <laughs> Do you see all that stuff? Ah! Oh, 
Uh, uh, why don't this, the theme show for like... Hold on. My thing crash! Is my thing crashing? PR place, yeah. I think. Wait, wait, wait. I'm still here. But do you guys know what happened because of this? Hold on. It didn't crash, but I am no longer able to move. Hold on. Okay, there we go. It didn't move me back correctly. <laughs> Yeah, 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 stun blocked me. <laughs> oh god, I beheaded him. <laughs> I'm fine. But it, space bunnies regrow their heads, it's fine. We grow back any body part that we lose. And it just becomes stronger. So I have just become... Hmm. Did I lose my head? Or did I lose my body? Did I become smarter or did I become stronger? I guess we'll see. Ugh. So their name is Lavender. Who are you people? What are your new friends? I like how the name says new friends. With a question mark. <laughs> Thank you for the one bit PR place. You're being so nice. Thank you. Thank you for beheading me. <laughs> We're your new friends. I'm calling the police. <laughs> Is that a weed? Had to start with that and this. Ah, uh, you got you just gotta bunk me as a hello, huh? Wait. I don't have my phone. Now I can't play gotcha games! Why is she acting like that for? Yeah, I'm deficit, but I'm giving over a thousand bits to me. <laughs> I, are you feeling anything different happening? Are you beginning to morb? They DM'd me pictures of toast sandwiches. Oh, I saw that in the Discord. Oh my god. <laughs> I de actually DM'd you that? God, I love them skellies. They're adorable. You got games on your phone? <laughs> Grim hasn't given her the lowdown yet, remember? Oh! Good thing we have balloons. Everyone loves balloons. Not the turtles! Welcome! It's my moment to be annoying to you guys, but I think I'm annoying to you guys every moment of the day. So uh, here's my extra annoying moment called Elio's Animal Corner. Don't release balloons out into the sky. And I'm not saying that to encourage you guys to do it. I'm like being legitimately like serious here when I say this. Uh, those balloons will go up into the sky, into the stratosphere, until they eventually pop. And a lot of them will land into the ocean and kill a lot of ocean creatures. So it's not good. It's not good. It's like, uh, another tip. Uh, you guys ever get those, like, little mini, like, cans? With the little wrapper thingy around them? Uh, make sure to cut those up before you throw them away. Because a lot of animals will get stuck in those and they can die. They can suffocate. And like, uh, some stuff also that is like translucent, like when, when problem is like, you know, bags and like, uh, see-through balloons and stuff is like a lot of animal creatures will, that eat, you know, jellyfish and stuff will think that it's jellyfish and try to eat it and then they will suffocate off of it and die. So it's not a good thing. If you care about your fellow animals, which I am an animal. Try and not do that, please. Okay, this is it for Elio's annoying corner. But yeah, not everyone loves balloons. <laughs> Thank you for the five bits. Oh, look at that bit. That took a while to fall. I never even had those things for cans, actually. I think that's an American thing. Wouldn't surprise me if it was an American thing. 
What if I live in mid-America as far away from the ocean as possible? You see, the thing is, the thing is, you never know where your stuff will go. You don't know how far up the balloon will go into the stratosphere before it pops, how far the wind will take it, or even how far someone else might take it, or like a bird or something might grip onto it. You, you really never know. There's a lot, there's a lot of things that go into that. So yeah, oh wait, I just noticed chat is off. So let me move that. Let me move that. You don't speak Americanish. <laughs> Honestly, chat is as annoying as Elio. Problem is, there's a lot of us in chat, and only one of Elio. I, I guess I better clone myself. Chat is off. Sorry, it's my fault. <laughs> Once found a balloon that had a name and phone number on it. I called it, and they said they let it go a couple months before. Yeah, you, you really don't know, like, where your stuff is gonna end up when you let it go into the sky, so it's best not to do it. Like, if you like balloons and stuff, like, keep it indoors. Or, like, make sure if you must go outside, like, you're at an amusement park, like, wrap that shit nice and tight around your wrist. And, like, uh, don't let balloons go for fun. A lot of people let balloons go for fun at, like, weddings and stuff, and they don't realize that they're killing a lot of animals by doing that. But yeah, anyway, that's Elio's animal corner of the day. Sorry for being annoying, but I always feel like I need to say it because I want people to stop killing animals without realizing it. It's not their fault. Uh, it's not their fault, by the way. If you ever did this, I <laughs> thank you for the five bits here, please. But yeah, I just want to also say to anyone that might for example, hear what I'm saying and feel bad about it. Uh, don't blame yourself. A lot of this is innocent shit that no one could ever really see coming because we have a society uh, where this stuff is kind of normalized and no one realizes. It's like the whole thing with cat milk. Cats shouldn't drink a lot of milk, but the way that a lot of cartoons and stuff show it makes people think that cats, like, really enjoy milk and the same is for bunnies with carrots like bunnies shouldn't eat carrots a lot like you know carrots are okay every once in a while but i'm oh, i'm so sorry i'm getting off on a tangent i'm getting off on a tangent talking about animals i'm sorry i just really like animals i i want to if i ever made it big someday i want to donate a lot of money to conservation efforts so, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know what you mean. I just completely forgot that was a thing. <laughs> we live in a society. Elio 2020-2022. Oh, thank you for the change hairstyle. There we go. Put my head down. Alright. Anyway. Enough with this balloon slander. N except not really. I will continue to slander balloons. Where are my balloons? Crap. Everyone, shoot! Ah, oh, Grim, must we? Oh, so this is the Hollow Man? Is he part of Hollow Life? No parties are to be thrown until the newbie is initiated. And no party is to be thrown without me. Oh my god, a guy that's a little full of himself. Ah! Thank you for the nine bits, PR, please. Happy Pride! Also, I just got a spam call from someone. Go away. That's the only time I ever get a phone call. Is to try and trick me into paying for a car I never purchased. Especially with my balloons. Wait, I should do Yeah, I like that voice. Especially with my balloons. Ugh. Come on now, everyone. Out. There will be cake later. Oh, they're so cute. Look at that one. He's a little slow. You can do it. Keep running. I'm sorry if they scared you. They're a bit overwhelming. Oh, is he actually like a nice guy? 
Maybe he saw it that they were like overwhelming me. What is happening? Ooh, ooh, I see a baby dad. Yes! Hello, Barrett! We're playing a new RPG Micro game! At least for me. I know this game has been out for a while. Right, I'll just be straight about it. You're dead. Huh? You're dead. No, I heard you, but why are you here? Well, unfortunately, your spirit isn't strong enough to move on. How did I get killed, though? Did I get killed by a hot girl? Or did I get killed in an embarrassing way? Like, my, my underwear got, like, flipped out in front of everyone and I died of a heart attack from embarrassment. This is very important. Ooh, this is pretty. Here at Grimm's Hollow, spirits such as yourself help deliver ghosts to become stronger. Oh, so we help people move on. Ghosts? We're gonna play the game till the game is done or when we feel like ending. Hell yeah, yeah, boys! People whose spirit is too strong makes them, making them frenzied. Wait, what? I can't read this. People whose spirit is too strong making them frenzied and unwilling to go. That doesn't sound like a real sentence. Is that a real sentence? I feel like something about that is off. Oh my god, what? Barrett! <laughs> Thank you for resubscribing! I'm hoping you get a happy day and a great future. Ooh, ooh. I am definitely having a great happy day. And I hope that you also get a happy day and a great future, Barrett. Ooh. I also saw your, your tweets, so I'm, I'm happy that You've been having, like, a good interview. That makes me very happy. We reap those in, uh... It's a topic for another time. For now, you need to rest. Did I get killed in an embarrassing way? Why did I just think of Konosuba? <laughs> oh, yeah. I remember how he died in Konosuba. That was so shitty. <laughs> yeah, I would rather just die than have to deal with that. There are fresh robes for you on the bedside cabinet. The local baker has also been kind enough to give you. Deliver ghosts so we deliver spirits, alcohol. Is that why so many, like, ghosts and stuff about death are associated with alcohol? Because spirits, oh my god, I can't believe that just, I just caught on to that. There are fresh robes for you on the bedside cabinet. The local baker has been kind enough to give you some donuts and cookies free of charge. Unfortunately, we don't have milk. Then what's the point? What kind of donuts are these? Are these the chocolate donuts with the, with the like light brown inside? I can't eat those without milk. You gotta take a little nibble off of it. Dip it in the milk, make it all soggy, and then eat your donut. What's, what's the point otherwise? Or, or, do they have filling? Then that's fine, but I can't, can't have this without milk. What the hell? This ain't a good death day. Wait! <laughs> We've gotten over a thousand bits and four subs, and it's only been half an hour. Welcome to my chat where everyone is incredibly nice and also incredibly mean at the same time. I love you guys. <laughs> Do you know where my brother is? Timmy? He, he's being babysitted by Vicky right now. <laughs> I'd rather just die than have to deal with that, Elio. You just said you would rather die than die in an embarrassing way. I mean, I would rather... Not be seen. You're right. You're right. Never mind. Never mind. Sorry, little one. I don't know a Timmy, but if I meet a Timmy, I'll tell you. God, they only have pilk. Let's go! Have a good rest. Cookies with feelings? What? What, what do you mean? You, you guys' cookies don't scream at you when you put them in your mouth? What kind of cookies you guys eating? can't stay here. This may be some sort of weird, weird cult. I should put on the robes so I can blend in and escape. 
Oh, baby. Do I got any items? Ah, we got a bunch of stuff. Lavender spirit. Hey. Oh, wow. We got, like, stats and stuff. Flinch needs ten thingies. Okay, cool. So we got, like, a skill tree. I wonder if you can inherit all that stuff or if you have to, like, be very careful. Like in, like, Dead by Daylight. Uh, one thing I don't like is how you have to go back into the menu to do everything. Oh, I like how the save is called Death. Okay. I guess that's everything. I like how these balloons have little happy faces. Very cute. Surrender milk. Embrace tea supremacy. I actually had tea today. Um, so like my uncle had like physical therapy. Um, and I didn't have work for like another two and a half hours. So I walked down to like, uh, to find a place that was open because it was very early in the morning. And I found like a, a coffee place and they had tea. So I had Earl Grey cream tea. Took fresh robes and a reaper mask. Also took two delicious donuts and three spooky cookies. Ooh, ooh. Oh, hey, I'm wearing it. Nice. Can I like... Do they have descriptions? <gasps> oh, they have little pictures. I love that. A sugar cookie glazed with frosting. Disclaimer. Does not actually taste like death. Restores 100 WP. Damn it. I was hoping it tasted like that. Pilk supremacy. What is pilk? It is the combination Pizza Hut, milk, and Pepsi. And it is delicious. It tastes like a creamy, less, uh, rooty root beer. Oh, it's locked. Huh. <sighs> of course. Just remember I'm going out for a karaoke night. Ooh, help you have fun. Hey! Hey? I can help you. I saw Timmy in a cave. Cave? Yes, it's where the reapers go to reap. Oh god. Don't worry, he was safe the last time I saw him. Where can I find him? Which way? Hi, his helper, I'm Twy. Also helper, I hardly know her. Phew, both in one go, I'm on fire. <laughs> Twy! Just go left and exit out of town. Then head into the first cave you see. You'll find him in there. But do me a favor and don't tell anyone I was here, yeah? Hey, everyone, I found a ghost in here. You guys want to reap him? Oh, God, no, why? Why would you do that? No. <laughs> It tastes good. See, look, I'm gonna have some right now. Look at this, look at this. I'm gonna have some pilk. Wait, where is it? Where is my pilk? There we go. Oh wait, that's a bit. I grew an extra arm. I was like Shiva for a second. There we go. Delicious, delicious pilk. Anyway, back to the game. <laughs> You know, those reapers, they're kind of nuts. I unlocked the door for you. Good luck. Uh, thank you. Hi, I'm on fire. I'm bionic. <laughs> Streamer choice supremacy. No, weeping ghosts. Ghosts, good boy. <laughs> to me, pilk is one of those things where you will drink once and never again. Joke's on you, because, yeah, I haven't had pilk since that one stream. <laughs> Just head left to exit out of town and then enter the first cave to reach Timmy. Timmy Tommy. Shelves are full of odd titles. Take a glance, of course. Book of names. Reapers who have left us. Ghost encyclopedia. Caring for your sight. You don't feel you have time to read them. The shelves are full of odd titles. Yeah, a grim dictionary. Essential words for a reaper. Death. Shinde. Kimi ga shinde. Coming to terms with death. An illustrated guide. All right, what's in this room? Hey, it's like the little old dorm. Hold on. I hate how this save button is like all the way over, like in the middle of it. I'm not gonna be used to that. 
Huh? Me? I like the music. I'm just trying to look out the window. I've never seen a view like this when I was alive. No sun, no moon, no concept of time, night, or day. Okay, so we're we're in purgatory then. Or we're in Hello Charlotte. We're in the house. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to freak you out. <laughs> sorry, I don't want to talk. I need to wake up my partner. He needs to restore his willpower. That's a mood. Oh, I can't talk to him? Wait, there we go. Oh, he won't let me talk to him. You can't tell whether they're asleep or awake or dead. So I like how the beds have like little Z's on them. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, where are we going? Where are we dropping, boys? Oh, hey, is this a shop? Welcome to Grim's Hollow. Hey, that's the name drop. Y you got anything for me? You just gonna drop the name of the game and nothing else? Rather drink Orange Joe rather than this pilk you guys are so fond of. Okay, Orange Joe sounds like legitimately disgusting. Orange and coffee. Also like my stomach cannot handle coffee. Like, that feels like a, a way too high of a sugar rush and too much caffeine. Oh, hello. My friend and I were supposed to meet at the bakery and eat some pastries. But I think they've stood me up. No, it's just me and my new friend, the balloon. You better bring it inside, lonely reaper. Or you're gonna be dead, reaper, when I'm done with you. You bitch! You bitch! Weren't you listening to me too? Weren't you listening to me earlier? You asshole! You just killed a turtle! I hate you! Get out of here. Fuck this dude. Yeah, maybe your friends left because you're a filthy turtle killer! I'm trying to eat a donut. Go away. Fuck you too. Hey, broski, I've been thinking. If this is all we eat, how are we able to process all this sugar? Shouldn't we be fat from all these carbs or something? That's something I think about whenever I think of sands. There's no such thing as carbs when you're dead. But where does the food go? You don't got an esophagus, you just got the little bones. You don't got a throat to shove that stuff through. Now shut up and eat your cake. Fine. The Reaper pokes the chocolate cake with a fork. F that bitch. <laughs> hey, I wanna get this bread? Let's get this bread. Have you seen Timmy? Sorry, but there's no Reapers called Timmy in the hollow. You can trust me on that one. I know all of my customers. Um, who's asking anyway? Me, I'm asking. No one. <laughs> Lavender sweating under the mask. <laughs> That's what the point of the mask is. Are you a reaper? Technically speaking, I am. I don't have enough spirit energy, a little sparkly, to pass on. But I don't reap any ghosts. I prefer to bake. So call me Baker, please. Sounds like a last name. Why is there a bakery here? Reapers don't need to eat to survive, but even if we're dead, we still get tired. A reaping can be very draining, if it's a difficult one. So I sell bread that restores willpower, a heart, during a reaping. Yeah, but how do they eat them? That way, reapers don't faint out of exhaustion. How do they get exhausted? They get to spend more time collecting spirit energy. <laughs> Sparkly from ghosts. All I ask for in return is a small portion of spirit energy. Sparkle. Oh, whoa. what did I do? So then one day I can pass on myself. What is this? Angel beads? Anyway, let me get rid of this. 
I love to see my influence on people in chat. You hate to see it. <laughs> Grim's job is, after all, to make sure everything in the hollow passes on. And jelly beats? <laughs> Have you guys seen Angel Beats? That was like one of the first ever animes I watched online when I got my laptop. Though really, it didn't take much to convince Grim to let me bake instead of reap. All I had to do was give him a taste. Okay. Uh, let's go shopping. Oh, spooky cookie, deathless donut, morbid muffin, just a chocolate cake, and a m I'm buying these morks. That that's just a that's like this this world's like version of pilk. I'm pretty sure. Full fire. Yeah, this is this is pilk. This is pilk. Mork. Mork. Yeah, I'm, I'm buying that when I got the money. Yes, angel beads. Yeah, yeah, my niece wrecked angel beads to me. Type in hard while eating sandwich. Ooh, it was the fourth anime I watched. Ooh, nice. Yeah, I cried. I cried. I... Who's your guys' favorite character? I think I'm very predictable when I say my favorite was Tenshi. Or I should say is. She's always, she's always gonna be my favorite character. This cave is void of territorial hazards, save for all initiated reapers. Oh, there's some flowers over here. Hold on. Let me save just in case I fall off the cliff. Oh baby, there's some reapers over here. What you got? A fainted reaper. Reaper creeper. Oi, get up. The reaper prods his partner with the butt of the scythe. Wow, Elio liking the character that starts out as an enemy. What a surprise! I don't like her because she's an enemy! I like her because she's a kurere! I like kureres. And she's cute. Hmm. Hmm. Yuripe fan club here. Yuripe is great. Honestly, I really like all of the cast. I would understand you, Twy, if I said that I liked uh, that other student body person that was with Tenshi because they were a bit more villainous than Tenshi was. She was like the police, you know. She was like neither good nor bad, just kind of doing her job. I forgot the name, but Blue Haired Boy was my fave. His episodes were really emotional, heartwarming in the end. Was that the baseball guy? I don't like her because she's an enemy. He lied. What? Yeah, I know who you're talking about, and they're definitely the actual problematic character. Also, also, I do like that character. Did I hear Reaper Creeper? I wanted to like make a reference to that one like Halloween thing, but <laughs> Hinata, I think best husband though. I just want to make fun of you, oi. Also, thank you for the hydrate, Isilla. I'm gonna drink my cake batter. Thank you. I love how predictable you are, Elevio. Shut up! Shut up! I honestly just mostly remember the jokes that spawned on that episode. They were trying to make her fail her exams. <laughs> All right, back to the game. The Reaper prods his partner with the butt of the scythe. Up uh, now. Don't wanna. Too tired. Damn. He just like me, for real, for real. North, waterfall cavern. East, ghastly cavern. Grim's Hollow. Ooh, that's the that's the name. That's the name thing. Death Cavern closed. West, nothing special. There's gonna be something. There's gonna be something. Hello? Sorry, but cave's closed. It's permanent with exploding ghosts, large gaps, and broken bridges. Also, to, to answer your question, um, the thing that I was making a reference to was Jeepers Creepers. 
which is like a, a story about a, a killer uh, that inspired like a, a horror movie called Jeepers Creepers. Until Grim finishes restoring it, this area is off limits. Uh huh. It's talking about dead turtles pretty late, I know. Did you ever play Turtle Head yet? Yes, I have. And I have mixed feelings on Turtle Head now. Uh, because I have some friends that were connected to the devs of Turtle Head. Um. And it's kind of a, a messy breakup between some people that were involved in Turtle Head. So I can't say nowadays whether or not I'm like a Turtle Head fan. I enjoyed it a lot, but it's a bit awkward now to like look back on it. Please note this cave is slippery and damp. Take extra caution when crossing puddles. This cave is open to all reapers. Grim. Yeah, he played Turtle Head. I definitely remember that. One of the creators of the remake came in stream and everything too, if I recall correctly. Yeah. Geez, what a cheesy song. My mom loved it. Oh, your mom listened to Jeepers Creepers? How did you get those thought? Get how did you get those thighs? Oh, a movie? Oh, okay, so your mom watched the movie then. Yeah, that sucks. I wasn't aware of that. That sucks. Yeah. I mean, it, it's not really... Like, I don't want to get into it. Uh, I don't want to get into it, you know? It's just a little awkward. Because there's still some people on the dev team that I enjoy, but there are also some people on the dev team where I saw some shit that they did. But it's not within my position to talk about it because I was personally not involved with the things that happen. But one of my friends was, and when something happens to one of my friends, I get more offended than if it were to happen to me, you know? This isn't the cave the ghost mentioned. Damn it. Gotta go to a different cave. Fine. Alright, let's go in this one. It's dark in here. Guess I'll take off the mask. Timmy, are you in here? Gah. Wow, what a fresh face. You must be the newbie. I get why you wouldn't want to play it. Yeah. What? A lot of mixed feelings with that one. <laughs> yes, I am. Can you help me? If you're looking for another reaper in here, you'll need a scythe. Here, take mine. Thanks, but why? Oh, heads up. Oh, tutorial battle. Should I teach you how to fight? Yeah. Ooh, this is music. Ooh, I like this music. Funky time. I just realized... Hold on... Has the game been like this all day, guys? Hold on... There you go. It's a ghost! Unlike us, it has way too much... Sparkly spirit energy! We need to reap that energy, right? Fire special power. But it doesn't 
does have that sort of off style, yeah. It's like a colored off game, kind of. Okay, Pierce. Do an attack which ignores defense, all right. <laughs> Circle Enix or Equilateral Enix. What has Circle Enix or Equilateral Enix ever done for the Edgy Belt Boys fandom? Is my question to that question, Twy. You can use it to increase your strength, speed, defense, and special power. Equilateral Triangle Enix, sorry. Equilateral Triangle Strategy. Or you could just use it to learn new special moves for combat. You can access it from the menu by pressing X and selecting Newbie Spirit. Once a Weeper has completed their spirit by filling it up with energy, they can finally move on. Okay. Anyways, I shouldn't hold you up. Go find your Timmy. I'm sure he's missing you. If you ever need any extra help, I'll be around. And don't worry about dying. We're already dead. <laughs> But I look different from you guys. I guess. If you need help, read the manual. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Don't look so aggravated. <laughs> you can't question my question, but I just did, Twy. I just did. Here's a piece of advice. If you find swinging too hard, try working on your speed. Ooh. Going to sleep though, but just dropping by to say hi. Hello there, kippies. Nice seeing you before you go to sleep. Have a good, sweet dream. When you're faster than a ghost, the bar moves slower when you're swinging. Oh, you're having Wi-Fi problems? Sorry to hear that. Hopefully it's back up and good and running for you when you wake up, kippies. Oh, we got some ghosties. I like this music. Oh boy, two of them? Oh lord. Out on me. 
Just to know, what are your normal streaming schedules? Oh, uh, I post my streaming schedules on Discord and Twitter and when I remember to do it. YouTube. <laughs> The ghost faded away. But yeah, if you wanna look, I, I'm, I'm a little, I'm a little behind in my schedule cause I didn't stream yesterday. But this is the schedule I have. Let me just save this real fast. I don't actually know if I have this saved. Let me see. Sometimes I'll make schedules and just immediately throw it in the trash bin. <laughs> Yeah, let me let me show you this. Probably not gonna do hat in time today, uh, but uh, this is somewhat my schedule. This is somewhat my schedule. Oh, whoops, wrong image. Wrong image. Oh, wrong image. Wrong image. Sorry, sorry. Um, here's the image. There's the, there's the schedule. And I tend to make it my pins tweet on Twitter. Pilk, no! <laughs> the, the video with this as the thumbnail is going up tonight. <laughs> By the way, on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, goodbye! B -b 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 bye Okay, back to the game. Back to the game. Elio, what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, it's the perfect image to use. Wait, wrong image. It's the perfect image to use for the Sonic stream. It's perfect. A perfect recreation. In MS Paint. Elio, I'm torn between saying I love you and I hate you. <laughs> I'll take that as a win. Two spirit energy reads. <laughs> okay, how's my health? Okay, we're doing. Okay, right, let me look at my my skill tree. What should I work on? What is this? Defense. Okay, so we got sleepy time energy. Red flame. Okay, so that's a skill. Flinch. Is that like the skill on Amori? Okay. I guess I don't really have that much stuff just yet. Oh, look at this dude! That's a cute, that's a cute, that is a cute ghosty. That is one adorable little guy. Carol! Emphasis is Caroling! <laughs> oh, wait. You little bitch, you're, you're a healer? I'll kill you. Alright. Oh my god. I keep running out of HP. I wonder how hard this game is. Is it like light eat levels? Or like end roll levels? I can't tell just yet. I mean, the fact that we got a skill tree makes me think that the dev put a lot of thought into this. Oh, so, oh my god. Why is my... My throat really weird right now. <coughs> Is it cause I'm drinking cake batter? Is that why? My throat's like, no, you can't drink cake batter. Elio. Thank you for the hydrate, Twy. Healer, I hardly know her. Which is why you'll kill the healer. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta drink the last of my uh, cake batter. It's all the way at the bottom. You're drinking cake batter? Yes. Okay, so uh, it's not exactly cake batter, but it's also cake batter. It's a cake batter smoothie. Um, It's cake batter ice cream turned into a smoothie. Elio, drink water. Why? It's just ice cream. It's just cake batter and ice cream. And it's good. It's good. So it's got lots of whipped cream. Oh shoot, I just... Okay. I gotta put this away. 
I just tripled. <sighs> Hold on, I got, I gotta find like a, where's my paper towels? Now is probably a good time to add. Or right, jump in the oven, we can still save the wasted batter. <laughs> it wasn't too much batter. It just got all over my hands because I splattered it out of my mouth from laughing. Anyway, I'll go. Okay, fine, 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 chat. I'll go grab some water, okay? But just for anyone that's curious, cake batter? Ice cream? Pretty good. It's not as thick as regular cake batter. Anyway, which cup? Oh, that was my milk cup from earlier. I'll go grab another cup. Like buttermilk batter, 
Like, a lot of milk is, like, kind of, like, thick and makes, like, the little noise when you, like, drop it in. That's what I meant by it's not as dumper as regular batter. Oh, <laughs> God. We don't drink Mari, we do hang Mari's though. I wanna drink Mari. Anyway. Back to the game. Please note that ghost caves sometimes have ghost walls. Ooh. These are illusionary walls which hide secret entrances. You can make them disappear by facing a wall and pressing Z. Try not to get lost. There was a ghost wall around here. If I poked and prodded this wall with my scythe, then nothing's happened. Oh, that. Wait. No. Hold on. Will he come back? Oh no, I lost him. Hold on. Let me save on a different file. I don't wanna miss that dude. I gotta kill him all. Oh, wait. Maybe I'll come back and kill it off stream. Don't worry, I will kill him. Okay, come here, dude. Let's go. Oh my god, it's cute! Baby! It's like a little. Oh no, he's a little bunny. He's a sleepy bunny. They speak my life. <laughs> Jackie is truly my mama. Spirit energy reaped. Jackie's a bunny. Poor bunny. Well, actually, Jackie, Jackie is a sloth. Come here, let's fight before you fade away. <gasps> a ghostling. Where's the change? Oh my god. He's a hard hitter. be a sloth, but I carry you all the same. Ah, thank you. And before that's robophobic, thank you, Jackie, for banning the bot. Okay, we got red flame. What should we... Hmm. Information. This ring causes the spirit to stop moving for four moves. Oh, okay. And what was this one? Wait, no. Not that one. Is it this one? This flame multiplies your special attribute by two to deal damage. Only works against red spirits. Hmm. Don't think we're fighting red spirits yet. So let's learn flinch. Oh, ha. Huh. So you can, like, double upgrade your skills. Okay. Alright, let me... Oh, wait. There's, like, a little thingy up here. How do I get there? There's gotta be a... Well, they were just talking about a special wall. How do I get there? Oh, maybe that go- 
ghost was like a hint? Oh! I see. I see. Well, let me... Let me buy some items first. Before I go over there. I wanna fight a bunny. Oh! I just put the mask back on. Alright. I'll be so MIA this weekend. I the Somnium Files too! Oh wow! That's right, it is coming out! Man, that is so insane. That that's coming out. But I wanna buy the Mork. I wanna buy the Mork. Damn it. Okay. Um I guess I'll buy one of these. Oh wait, that's also- wait, 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 wait. Oh! The money in this game is also your skill upgrade points. Oh, so you gotta be careful. How you play, so that you don't waste too much. Oh! You can regrind! Okay, that makes everything better. Okay, good. explaining that. Can I go over there? There should be like a hidden wall or something. Oops. There's hat. Oh! There's hat on the ground. Yeah, definitely don't Google the game if you don't want to get spoiled. Oh! T 10 SE. For this game? Or for another game? Why people in my city just looks me bad when I put a mask for an Uber. Why? See, my response if someone was like that to me, I would be like, bro, I've been wearing a mask since before the pandemic. I wear it whenever I want to, cause I like it. Yeah, this game, ooh, okay. Okay, Jerry. Yeah, the same name as my uncle. Even before the pandemic, I even had Lysol in my office. I wouldn't say my germaphobic, but I'm pretty close to, yeah. It's good to like be cautious, you know? Also, fucking yikes, I feel you though. It's crazy how people think it's weird to wear a mask in public nowadays, even though the pandemic isn't even over. What the fuck? Yeah! That's some fucky wucky shit right over there. Hand sanitizer, I hardly know her. Even before then, 
Who cares if people wore a mask or not? Yeah. Like, it's my face. Like, it's one thing if someone's telling you to wear it and you don't want to wear it, but I'm voluntarily choosing to wear it because I like to wear it. And like, if I'm sick, I don't want other people to catch it. Like, even before the pandemic, I would do that. Wait, let me buy some... I buy some delicious yum yum donuts? Okay, let's buy two, I guess. But yeah, if you'd like to know how the endings happen, feel free to ask. Oh, look. Ooh, okay. Have I, like, missed any requirements just yet? I didn't get sick into all 2020 and mid-2021, not even a cold. Masks are OP. Yeah, I haven't gotten sick. Oh, wait. <gasps> Shimatta. I wasn't paying attention. Oh? Hey, you passed out in there. Looks like the ghost you fought gave you a rough time. Um, let me save in a different save file. Wow. Oh, wait. It healed me. It's just mostly dependent on whether you maxed out your skills or not. Oh, uh huh. So I'm guessing this is like... Very grind heavy, perhaps. Bruh, stop! <laughs> but yeah, like, ever since the pandemic, I think I got sick, like, only a few times, and I've never caught COVID. It's almost like wearing a mask prevents you from catching an airborne disease. Funny how that works. If you put hand sanitizer on a person, you don't know that's weird. Okay, yeah, so feel free to make at least, like, two different safe files. Okay. One where I don't grind and one where I do grind. Maxing out skills until the very end. Oh, okay. So, like, is it okay if I do, like, every skill except for one? Or is it, like, one bit hard? Or, like, the amount of skills you get determines stuff. Barrett had said hand sanitizer. I hardly know. <laughs> Speed is super busted in this game. If I recall, it throws away the fun, though. Ah. Uh, I'll try not to do that, then. If it throws away the fun of it. Just says that skills have to be maxed out. Okay, so like, if I leave one not maxed out, it won't like, we're in my, like, like, you know the strategy in One Bit Heart is like to go through the entire game without friending people. And then like, uh, you know, the, the last friend event is where you get all of your endings. Okay, how do I admit this dude? I mean, that's the case. Okay. Okay, that kills him. Go through the entire game without friending people. Hey, that's my IRL strategy. <laughs> I didn't know you were a pro one bit heart player. Why? Will this hurt Jerry? Okay, there we go. I'm guessing you need to use skill. Yeah, I'm guessing you have to use skills on this guy. One white heart, one bit heart. You know, like the things that we people use on Twitch? It's my favorite game. Survivor. Speaking of which, I should get to it at some point, but I have so many ongoing things. The game where Elio's ultimate kin is from. Yes, people, don't be like, oh, that isn't that your turn to die? No. It's one bit hard. Your turn to die? No! One bit hard! I'm gonna nauseate Kenny! 
It's not a combination of Nanashi and Shinny. It's Nanashi ni. Nanashin, can you shut up? I didn't know Yoshi Nanase was in your turn to die. Wow. <laughs> okay. I need to go back and buy some more. We just seem to be cranking up more spirit energy, poor enemy, now though. So I guess the more people you kill, the more spirit energy you get with each death. Is my assumption? Oh, you're a level 7 Shin Kinney. Why, 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 why? Let's see. Yeah, I think the delicious donut is best for now. I'll just grab two for now. Because I do want to upgrade my skills. Grom. He's level 774 Shin Kinney. Oh, hey! It's supposed to be a Nana Shin! Ah, he's a Nana Shin Shinny. Why, why, why? Can I, can I end stream? Good night, everyone. Guys, I'd say I can't believe Elio hasn't banned me, but he banned me in Barnes chat. Yes, I was I was very pleased that day when I did that. I was like, finally, after all this time, I can ban him without feeling bad. I mean, I didn't ban him, ban him. I just I just timed him out. But <laughs> it was like a weight was lifted off of my shoulder. So stop sighing at me. I'm not your tax helper. I don't know how to do taxes. Sorry that your expenditures are too much. All right, I like the little ghosties in the background, they're cute. A weight was lifted off my shoulders. Am I the devil on your shoulder? I guess I'm... Devil surviving. <laughs> I always feel bad about banning such timing out people unless they genuinely piss me off. Yeah, same here. Are you the Angelio on my shoulder? <laughs> Sorry, I keep sighing. <laughs> it's okay, Bear. Devil Survivor, I knew it! <laughs> we truly do have that connection, Twy. Hey! You prod the Reaper with the butt of your stick. Uh. Huh? Did I pass out? Oh no, that means I'm late. I'm supposed to be at the bakery. Thank you so much for finding me. Here's a reward for your trouble. Healing items. Yes! Thank you. This was a triumph. I'm guessing in this game it's like these walls that are like alternate paths. It's funny because I've seen a stream where there's a command to time yourself out. I did think of doing that, but I heard a while back that like uh, timing out someone too much uh, can eventually result in them getting, like, banned banned from Twitch without, like, any, like, mod doing it. Or something. It was some, some trouble thing that happens if you repeatedly, jokingly time someone out. So that's why I, I hardly ever joke time someone out. I'll, like, maybe do it once and then I'm like, okay, Survivor, I hardly know where. Ah! I guess I really didn't survive those devils. I've timed myself a couple of times, but haven't gotten any issue. Hmm. Does dying in this game like do anything? I'm just curious. Is this gonna like prevent me from getting an ending? Or is it 
like one of those games where it's like, yeah, it's okay to die. Like, like Baroque. Maybe it's like when you get multiple bands as opposed to timeouts. Maybe that was it. I'm not sure. But either way, it made me worry about like jokingly doing that to someone. Bands are when you need to appeal for the band. Mmm. Those are ghosts, Elio. Hey? What the fuck? I wouldn't think so. Lavender's already dead, and they just get tired and they get KO'd. Okay. So I should be fine. So it's kind of like a semi tough, but also like there's no fail state. Mind that. That saves me. That saves me time from having to walk again from a safe file. Alright. Let's find some ghosties and kill them. Okay. Have I been over here? Oh, yeah. That was the dude. Gotta go, it's 11 and I got work. Bye everyone. Oh, bye bye, Barrett. Have a good night. God, sorry this is really off topic. Nani. But I was looking into it because of what you said. Oh. What did I say? Eh. What were you looking into? <laughs> Yeah, bye. Oh, hey, this I like how these little guys kind of look like cats. Like little, little cat ghosts. Alright. Resilience. Double your defense. Okay. Yeah, let's get that. They say that they try to go into streams and just try to make a clever joke. And then they get banned. But often mods time them out even though their joke is harmless. Ah. Uh, you know, that kind of reminds me of like, a. Uh, I hate speaking ill of people that have been banned, but there is like one user that would frequently like, uh, make Goran log on references. Like in a joke. And it got like, a bit tiring. Like, uh... How do I say this? Like, every time you saw them, it was the same joke, and not in, like, a good way. Like, with Twy's jokes, I'm okay with it, because I find it funny. But with those jokes, it was just like... Like, they would always ask me, who the hell do you think I am? As like a Gurren Lagann reference. And you know, oh, I can't escape, I'm gonna die. Every time you saw them, it was the same joke and not in a good way. I'm glad I informed you enough that you felt the need to add not in the good way. <laughs> like you're the problem at the point? Are you really that dumb? <laughs> but yeah, like, they would always be like, just who the hell do you think I am? Just constantly. And they would always like ask me to do things during streams that was like awkward. And it was just not, not a fun time. And it wasn't just me that was like, you know what, this, this dude's a little, uh, you know? And so I was like, okay, yeah, that's a problem. 
So yeah, just like, if you're out there, watchers, and you wanna frequently make references to like, some anime, like, go ahead and log on. Don't frequently shove it down a person's throat. Like, and if you must, try and be like a little original with it. Do do something different with it. Don't just say, who the hell do you think I am every time I see you in chat. I don't know, I don't know how to word it, but it was definitely annoying. It feels really weird to talk about that now because that was like a long time ago. That was during the Okami streams. Oops. And it's hard to really like tell people like what what's good jokes, what's bad jokes. So I try not. But with that person, I definitely was like, hey, can you like stop? But they thought it was funny, so, you know. I feel a little bad about that, actually. <laughs> Maybe I should have communicated better. I don't know. But anyway. When am I gonna progress in this game? <laughs> Starts in the world of Undertale? Sussy. Sussy? I have not heard of this game, but Sussy's in it? Wow. I can't believe Deltarone and Double Survivor had a crossover. If so, that's entirely on them. If you were to ever say that one of my jokes were annoying, I'd overcorrect just to make sure not to be annoying. Mm -hmm. And I believe, like, another thing that was really awkward about them was, like, uh, talking to, like, my friends and, like, trying to get them to read the message. Like, I, I like to believe I'm a streamer that reads, like, a lot of people's messages. I like to believe I'm pretty active. I hate you for doing wrong to Sussy like that. It wasn't me. It really was not me, Twy. I did not choose Sussy's name. Chat chose Sussy's name. Oh. Listen, listen. Twy, Twy, read the overtaker's comment again. It's spelled Sussy. It's spelled Sussy. That's not on me. I read it as it was written. It's sussy. Susie, not sussy. It's spelled sussy. Look it up. The game is top notch. Like it starts with Susie saying, Chris, where the fuck are we? <laughs> Elio, no. Sus. I'm pretty sure that's how I spelled Sussy's name. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll do three. Is that like a way to heal? Other than using items or dying? No Delta Rune more than me. You could have guessed. But I wanted to make a devil survivor joke. Is that really so bad of me? Want to make a devil survivor joke, Mr. Devil Survivor? Huh? Devil Survivor! <laughs> okay, fine. I don't hate you. Thank you. You know I gotta be like, yo, Devil Survivor! Whenever I can. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, I will definitely put that 
on my playlist, The Overtaker. That, look, that sounds fun. <laughs> you know one game I really want to play on stream someday? I never played it, but I watched someone else play it. Uh, Undertale 2 Overtale. It is not a serious Undertale fan game. You play as Sans Undertale. Like, legitimately, that's his name, Sans Undertale. And then you... You use Dia Kurosawa. Medea Kurosawa. For like healing spells and shit. And then you fight Niko Yazawa from Love Life. To learn how to break people's Niko Niko kneecaps. And you like... Join forces with a... Uh, what the fuck was his name? What the fuck was his name? He was like the goblin. He's like a goblin with like a police chief hat from like Europe. <laughs> More importantly, I agree. It's super annoying when people repeat their messages to get the streamer's attention. If it's like a huge 1k viewer streamer, then sure, that makes sense. But honestly, even up to like 100 viewers, you should just wait because the streamer will probably try to catch up with chat eventually. Yeah. And sometimes, like, I'll see... Like, me personally, I'll see a comment and I'll be like, oh yeah. But like, I won't know how to respond. Sometimes I'm just like, I, I don't know what to say. Don't <laughs> Yeah, Undertale 2 is so funny. It's so funny. And like, uh, they were working on like a sequel to it, but I don't think they ever released it. And how many is gonna be a party member. Uh, but yeah. I, I love that game. That game's like comedy was top notch. Like really top notch. Funny, funny comedy. Oh, you binge. Come on. the streamer to do something or if they say things like oh no i'm being ignored yeah it makes me feel really awkward i'm just like Ehh. like i'm sorry for making you feel that way but wait what okay that was weird sorry i'm making you feel that way but come on my guy I think one of the worst ones is like, uh, when people will jump, like, uh, what is it? They'll dump trauma into, like, chat. I think that's my biggest pet peeve is, like, trauma dumping. I understand it if I'm, like, in a very, like, like, I start talking about something or, like, the game is related to something. Like, we can go into really deep talks, uh, during streams and stuff. But, like, if I'm, like, having fun and there's, like, nothing in the conversation to, like, ever have this be brought up and someone starts, like, trauma dumping in chat, I'm like, oh, oh. Especially because, like, streaming is kind of my, uh, escape from reality kind of thing. To like be up and then get dragged down with that. That's never from the regulars, yeah. 
It's just that, like, having, like, 50 people chatting at the same time is, like, hell on a streamer. Playing games and trying to answer, like, 30 questions must be hell. Yeah, it's really hard to dodge. Or not dodge. What was I saying? It's hard to balance it all. Because, like, you want to be playing the game and you want to be, like, entertaining. And you also want to interact. And I still don't quite know the perfect balance. I know I get, I get sidetracked a lot in my streams because I want to talk with everyone and like respond to them in a timely manner because I don't want people to think that I'm ignoring them. That's the point. It's already hard for the streamer. Don't make it harder. Streaming's rough. A lot of people are like, oh, streaming's easy. You play video game, get money, big money. But there's a lot of... A lot of mental factors to it. Like, it's good if you enjoy playing games and you enjoy talking to people. But you can't... You can't predict who's gonna be in chat. Is always the thing. <laughs> you never know when a scumbag read NN Twy will join stream. But I enjoy having NN Twy in chat. So I'm guessing the speed thing increases the like percentage like of that little square, because I notice it's a bit Have you upgraded your stats? I asked because you're still at 60 HP and it's been like half an hour. I have not upgraded my stats. I should really do that. <laughs> All right, let's see. So this is, okay, so this is HP. Okay, so now I have 100 HP. 100 HP. I think it's mostly with games that can have chat participation. Yeah. Among Us and... Oh, what was that other game? Uh, Jackbox. I love Jackbox when I play with, like, the regulars. But when, when there are people that I don't know that just joined, I get so nervous. That's also kind of why I make my Minecraft server be like, yeah, I gotta know you before you join. Because if I don't... There's, like, that, that chance, you know, someone's gonna join the Minecraft server and then they're gonna, like, grief it. A lot of people are gonna lose a lot of things. And that's not fun for anyone. I just don't want to risk that happening. Especially because a lot of the things that people have gotten so far, like, they go do a lot of links for it. Like, some dwarf was really going at it trying to get a cactus. So I don't want someone to come. 
come in. Grief is cactus and waste all those hours of like effort for it. And games that are super popular, yeah. Yeah. That's kind of why I'm glad that I do kind of like niche games. Because you hardly really get that. Both like niche games and also just the fact that I really like niche games. And I think that more people should get into them. Okay. Nine spirit energy. Okay, I'm not gonna buy items for a while. If I die, I die. like that or like Elden Ring or like Bloodborne or whatever. You get like a lot of people being all like, no, don't play it like that. You gotta play it like this. Yeah, Among Us is really harsh, especially with random people. Don't get me started on their Discord server. Oh my God. I can only imagine how rough the Discord server is. It might not be that bad, but god, the amount of backseating weird people in those kinds of streams. Yeah, I can only imagine. I can see like a certain few scenes from Breath of the Wild getting that kind of treatment. Sleep. Wood flame. How do I increase like oh, haste? Yeah, let's enhance that. What's this? Have the spirit's defenses for the rest of the reaping. Okay. Okay, I need a. I'm gonna save up for that one. Might not be that bad, but god. Oh, yeah, I already read that. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I always wanted to play like Bloodborne on stream. But also, I know that I, I'm not good at games. So I just know that there's like gonna be someone. Sees me in the Bloodborne category and comes and checks me out and gets like really angry at me for sucking at it. That's one thing I kind of got worried when I started Nocturne was like someone coming in that was looking for like a Nocturne streamer and being like, who let this idiot pick up a controller? Speed is OP, but you can add some. Okay, I'll add, I'll add speed. found something saying that 25 timeouts no longer permanently ban someone. Oh! <laughs> this whole conversation got started because of that. <laughs> oh wow, that's like, that's a lot of points. Oh, speed. Okay. Let's enhance some of that confidence. Wait. Okay, uh, let's learn some strength. What's this do? Terminate the spirit and gain their willpower. Oh, so you're like, that's like a drain move. Quick attack. I didn't know I was Pikachu. Red flame. Ooh, blue flame. Ooh, I like blue flames. Oh, purple flame. Okay, so that that's all the same stuff. It's like different. Special? Oh, the amount of specials I got, I guess? Don't have enough SE for this. Don't have enough Square Enix for this. I mean, hey, I will roast you during Nocturne, but if someone actually insults you, <laughs> I love you for that Pikachu joke. <laughs> the guys that are like, oh, you should do this state status spin tree drop strat. You haven't made the joke I would. <laughs> specials are for more damage on specials. Oh, okay. Hmm. Might work on the speed stuff then, since that's a P apparently. But I like, I like, I like gradually building myself up. It makes me feel powerful. Punch. And then flinch. 
doesn't mean that they won't attack. <laughs> hey, four spirit energy. I wonder if this is like... Okay, I might be going... The highway. And I should be going this way. Yeah, these look easier than like the shieldy boys. Oh, I was trying to get Carol. Whoops. <gasps> well, he got he got the Kirby eyeball. Look at that little lad. <laughs> Haven't seen that one much. Why would things like early Master Sword or item duping and surprisingly whistling whistle sprinty? Maybe I should grind off stream. That sounds like a good idea. All right, I only have five spirit energy. Wow. For context, since I'm guessing you're gonna be reading this, Elio, those are all Breath of the Wild glitches. And the last one is a super easy glitch. So trying to backseat that is just weird. I have heard about the, the whistle glitch. Was it Barn that told me or was it those few Breath of the Wild videos I watched? I'm not sure which one. This game looks super cute. It is super cute. I'm really bad at it, though. <laughs> Cause man, I I think like the the menu confuses me. Cause I think time keeps moving even when you're in the menu. Kind of like Final Fantasy, I guess. I have a hovering strap for speed runs now. You drop and pick up a bomb. And you're sent off to the stratosphere. Oh, wow. Okay, let's go, Carol. I need to get, like... Is there, like, a, a healing spell in this game? That would be nice. That way I don't have to go to the bakery and buy healing items. Yeah, BLS is, but I haven't seen people try to backseat that. Huh. Also, how's it going, Mendy? How you been today? I've been actually playing more Genshin recently. <laughs> it's kind of bad for me. I like stayed up until 4 a.m. playing Genshin last night. Never thought I'd say that. It's that weird glitch Barn and I mentioned to me a while ago. Janelio? <laughs> oh no, not more against it. <laughs> yeah! Dutch! I got Shinobu today and did her hangout. Oh yeah, that's right. So that was you that I saw on, on my following list. I wasn't sure if that was you or Song, because I like gave a, a cursory glance before I went live. Did you miss me calling you Shin? Wait, where'd, where'd you say Shin? What? Where? Where'd you call me Shin? I hate how naturally I'm writing Pilk for the Hydrate Eva. <laughs> Janelio. Oh. Yeah, that, that kind of kid 
is really not good for a healer. It always sounds like it could be a cool kit in games, but in actual practice, especially in meta stuff, like, like if it was like a PvP, then yeah, Shinobu really would be bad. Because you got people that are like having healers for the prime reason to keep like everyone alive. So they don't want to hurt the healer, because who's going to heal when the healers hurt, you know? Someone made a joke about her. She used to be a shrine maiden, so she's fortune cookie. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Thanks. That is really cute. That reminds me. Last night, I was watching like a... Oh, I feel like a nerd. I was watching Genshin Impact videos. the Honkai Impact and stuff. I didn't realize that there were so many Honkai Impact characters with like similarities to Genshin characters. You prod the Reaper with the butt of your stick. Ah! Oh, thank you for finding me. I was chasing down a ghost, but it disappeared and so did the exit. That sneaky ghost led me into an ambush. Grr. Here's a reward for your troubles. Ah, oh, thanks! Healing items. Think that you need SE for upgrading and for food. And that's why when you get full speed, you take almost no damage and you can use all your SE on your upgrades. Ooh. With the what of your stick? Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, tibi. Okay, I'm gonna heal with that. And then let's see what we can upgrade. Poison. Strength. Uh, let's increase speed. And then confident swing. Accommodate the spirit and gain their willpower. Yeah, I like that. That's like dream. And then we'll do another speed. Shatter? What's that? For the rest of the reaping in this shattering hit. I don't know if that actually does damage. Increase defense. And another speed enhance. Swing and immediately start your next move. Ooh, okay. I still don't fully understand the connection between Honkai and Genshin. Yeah, I was watching some, like, videos and people were talking about, like, uh... How, like, apparently the main character of, like, Honkai, people are, like, uh, theorizing to be that one god chick that you fight at the start of the game that, like, captures Lumine or Aether depending on your gender that you play as. And, like, I looked at, like, comparisons and stuff, and I'm like, is it really her? Like, I see see why people think like that. She uses like tubes and stuff, but isn't that kind of like a common design thing? I don't know. People are pointing out her eyes, but her hair is a lot different too. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a Hong Kai head. I'm not a Genshin head either, but you know. I don't know. Anyway, I think that would be cool to have the two games connected. Though that might make some Honkai fans angry. I know there's definitely been some contention from uh, Honkai with like Genshin people. Could you imagine living in a timeline where like, oh my god. Can I kill Carol? Crossover. Yeah, didn't Fischl... Wasn't Fischl in Honkai? Yeah, Fischl is in Honkai. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, what, what, what was I gonna say? Like, um... Uh, Honkai feels like the SMT of Hoyoverse. And, like, Genshin feels like the Persona 
of Hoyoverse. So I would say like if they made like the connections even more obvious than they are now, like Honkai fans would get angry. <laughs> I get what you mean, but I would like to say I have an example in mind of two characters whose designs were apparently just similar, but they ended up being connected. Not saying who, because relatively major spoilers. Not saying that's the case for Genshin, though, because I am not very familiar with Genshin and Honkai. Yeah, a lot of the characters, like, uh, there's apparently a Yae, like, Yae Sakura that looks a lot like Yae Miko from, uh, Genshin, and then, like, they even have, like, vessels or whatever in Honkai that are almost have the same abilities as the Archons in Genshin and stuff. It's crazy. That's odd. I could have sworn there was an entrance around here the other day. Must be right over here. Oh, boy. That don't sound good. That don't sound good. Do you guys think I'm built for this? I don't know if I'm built for this. Hold on. Got a delicious donut. Okay. Let me go and buy some items. I don't know. By the time I get back here, I'll run out of my items. Let's just go. If I die, I die. Go get them. All right. Timmy, where are you? Just hope they keep the connections between the games minimal. Oh, you meant from a different series, not from Genshin. Oh, gotcha. Don't wanna play Honkai, just to understand Genshin. Yeah. Lavender? Is that you? Timmy! Lavender! Hold on! I'm coming to get you! Oh, no you're not. Do you remember me? We met not too long ago at the inn. If you die, you can always put more points on speed. Gotcha. <laughs> well, I wouldn't think you'd care. You just raped a dozen ghosts like me. Uh, thanks for your help, but I'd like to collect my brother. Collect? That's a nice word for reap. Oh my god. <laughs> As someone who feels the need to watch all the series that are connection that are connected. I felt that. Shout out to the Arrowverse. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. You guys would not like dot hack then. <laughs> huh? No! I should never have helped you. You're just like the other reapers. I just want to take my brother and go home. Let me through. No, you've done enough harm. Ooh, jeez. You're not reaping him if it's the last thing I do. Oh, damn. Oh, my God. Harry the Platypus. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> now, let's see. Let's do... Double my defense. Wait, what? What happened? Honey? Oh yeah, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, that's... That's gotta suck. I know I haven't played a lot of events in uh, Genshin because of that. Ooh, oh my god, it's going so fast. They parry your damage. I see. So I gotta get rid of parry first. Alright, let's do confidence swing. Man, that hardly does any damage. I don't... Hmm. Oh, maybe I should do the flinch. So that he doesn't protect them. 
nervous. I may be tired. Oh my god, Carol, stop healing. Come on, Perry. Okay, let's see. Did their thing go away? No. Okay, it doesn't go away. I'll just keep flinching Perry then. I played a lot of vents. I heard vents among us. <laughs> yeah, I haven't played a lot of vents either because the game hates giving me impasta. Okay, I got rid of them. Let's get rid of you, Carol. critical hits now, and dodge. Oh wow, that's a lot of spirit energy. Easy clap. <laughs> Isn't there the new engineer role? Yeah, also apparently they added like a, a streamer option now to hide the code. So that's nice. I haven't played it in ages, but I'm pretty sure there's a new engineer ro role, which is a crewmate that can vent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's like guardian angel and and other stuff, like Mighty Morphin Power Imposter. Timmy, are you still there? Oh my god, Lavender, what's with your eyes? Oh, because I'm dead, so my eyes are hollowed out. I wasn't actually sure if that was a design choice or not. Lavender? Are you okay? That might be mods? I'm pretty sure the stuff I was talking about was like, like a legitimate role in Among Us now. Pretty sure. Y you can't be a ghost. T Timmy? Lavender? Eh? Why are you crying, Lala? Tim? Sorry, I'm, I'm moving my stuff around. Yeah? Hide inside my pocket. And whatever you do, do not come out until I say- Oh. Is Timmy- mm. Is Timmy like Lavender's pet? Stay invisible. Otherwise, I don't know if I can protect you. Is that clear? Okay. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Okay. I thought that was a flashback for a second. And I was like, wait. Okay. Never mind. Okay, they were talking about it in, like, modern day. There you all are, where were you? I was worried sick. Figuratively speaking, that is. I can't be sick, cause I'm dead. There will be Among Us VR now also. That must be wild to play, oh my god. That's crazy. I remember that they added three roles, but for some, I don't think they do the streamer thing. Yeah, it's just like a, an option that you can turn on that hides the code for like people that are streaming it so they don't have to put something up on their stream. If I had been a pet, I would like to remind you that if you need a break at some point, feel free to take one. Uh, thank you, Toy. Uh, I went for a walk. I wanted to stretch my legs. Oh yeah, and they're gonna make an Among Us manga, aren't they? Yeah, is that, is that out yet? I've been curious about that. That got announced a while back, right? I see. Well, now that you're up, I may as well invite you for tea. You can't thank me, that makes me sound like a nice person. You're not a nice person? Could've fooled me. <laughs> I don't suppose you mind walking a bit further? Yeah, I'll have... Oh, does this decide my ending? 
Should I have tea with him or should I go to my room and make sure that my brother is fine? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna treat Timmy like he's my cat. I wanna go to rest first. Oh well, my home is on the right to the inn. Drop by any time. No, I'm not nice. <laughs> you seem like a nice person, so you're toast. Oh, the <laughs> toast, toast is Twaya. Toast sandwich. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the meme, the Overtaker, but like toast sandwich has become a meme on our stream recently. <laughs> Elio, I swear. <laughs> Yeah, there's like a, a sandwich that exists out there that is just two pieces of to or two pieces of bread with a toasted piece of toast in the middle. It's terrible. And I hate it. Alright, let's do that. Oh no. What is with you guys and food? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not even that much of a glutton. As soon as I read toast, I knew it wouldn't end well. Elevate. <laughs> oh dear, did they say anything different now? Let's see. I'm sorry I was late. It's fine, no biggie. Uh, it is a biggie, cause you let go of your balloon out into the stratosphere. They look happy. I'm not happy. I'm angry. Are you a glut off? <laughs> Why does that sound offensive for some reason? One reaper stares into the distance and the other contentedly munches on a fresh donut. They both seem lost in thought. One oh wait, they just said the same thing. I'm trying to eat a donut. Go away, we oh, fuck you. Hey, it's the newbie! How's it going? Keeping up okay? I like this guy. He's a nice guy. Uh, wait, they only saw me with the mask before. This is the first time we've met. What do I say? Maybe they recognized you by your voice? Um... Hmm, what should I say? A uh, Grim invited me for tea, and I refused him. Huh, really? I'll admittedly take responsibility for Toast Sandwich. But I have no involvement in the pilk incident. <laughs> yeah, that was all me. I just remembered a meme at the top of my head and was like, huh, well, let me try this meme drink. And then everyone yelled at me for it. <laughs> oh, he's become better with people now, I guess. Grim didn't ask me out for tea when I started baking for him. I'm jealous. Oh, what's he going to... Do? Murder you and then throw your body parts down a river? Oh, don't look so scared. Lavender, was it? Grim's a chill entity? I'm not sure what he is. Grim spends half of his time managing the hollow, and the other half somewhere else. I suppose that makes him my boss, although I don't see him as one. Anyways, I'll just talk to you about life at the hollow. Life may not be the best word for it yet. <laughs> Afterlife, you mean? You got anything else? I think, is this the same stuff? I think this first question was about our brother before. Very good, newbie. But selling bread will always be slower than reaping ghosts. How come? It just is. Ghosts release so much more spirit energy in a reaping than the sales I make every day. Why don't you just raise your prices? Oh, I can't do that. No one would buy anything. But I don't mind that's gonna take me longer than other reapers. Sometimes, I do think about all the other reapers who have already passed on before me. But you're enjoying it. That's all that really matters. Doesn't matter if people got to the finish line before you. As long as you're doing what you enjoyed, that's the good thing. I wanted to join them, 
Yet, as time went on, I started to think Falcinon wouldn't be that great. This might be the temporary afterlife, but who knows what the real one is like. Oh god, even in death they're like, what's gonna happen when I pass on? Who is to say it's any better than this? Aww. I don't know what's waiting for me. Heaven, hell, nothing. That's why I think I'm okay selling bread for now. But please don't trouble yourself with my thoughts. Your job is to reap, and mine is to sell bread. Want a muffin? Oh, oh! Baker hands you a morbid muffin over the counter. Should you really be handing out freebies? This doesn't seem like a good business practice. I can make exceptions. Besides, I made too many. <laughs> oh my god, I love this dude. He's so <laughs> kakui. He's so cool. Baker Aniki. Existential crisis even after death SMH. <laughs> Thought I had enough of this existential crisis. They're taking it to the boat. <laughs> Been wondering for a while, five seconds. If you're hollow, when is Ichigo showing up? <laughs> you know what? Ichigo would show up. Would wait, wait. Cause we're technically reapers. Yeah, <laughs> this is all a big bleach crossover. <laughs> technically speaking, I am. I don't have enough spirit energy to pass on. But okay, that's the same. That's the same. It was just that one option that's different. You got any new items? <gasps> I wanna get Mork. I wanna get Mork. Someday I'll get Mork. You got anything different to say? Nope. Ichigo shows up this year, Dunny. <laughs> oh yeah, Tokyo Mew Mew? The remake? <laughs> So we just sleep? Or should I go? I guess, I guess we gotta go see the, the dude. And have some tea with him. I thought I had to put my pet away. Oh wait, yeah, he's not over here. But is there any new dialogue? He's out drunk. Cold. Okay, no. No new dialogue. Oh, no new dialogue. Look at the artwork of the muffin. Oh? Timmy! Oh, cutie! This fresh muffin has a blueberry flavor. Restores 200 WP. Oh, that's so cute! I love how they, like, make, like, little images for each item. I love when games do that. It's so adorable. No idea what you s said, but I heard I want to get more. <laughs> it's Morbin time. Okay, where's my, where's my guy? Oh, is this his house? He lives in like... You know, whenever I see stuff like this, I think that it's a bank. So he lives in a bank? Rich ass? Did you not pay your toll to the, to the fucking boat dude at Charon? So Lavender, which of these treats are your favorite? Is that a fucking detached head over there? Every food has the cutest art. <laughs> I want to squish Timmy. Timmy's adorable. No morbid. No. <laughs> Is it a cookie or a cake? Are you into muffins or donuts? I like them all. The baker is dying to know. Wait, that's not the correct word. Pardon me. <laughs> Are you talking about yourself? He is eager to know, yes. Ah, are you gonna say my preferences to Baker later? He's a nice guy. Ooh. I wonder if I'll get the item I say I want. I want cake, because I, I had cake batter. I drank cake batter earlier. Let's get some actual cake with that batter. Good taste. That too is my favorite. I guess his house is supposed to be shaped like a mausoleum. Oh, I can see that now. <laughs> 
pay your toll, but what about your tillin'? <laughs> Do I? Oh god, that just reminded me of something. I have a co-worker named Cole at my work. It takes every ounce within me. Like, I haven't talked to him yet. We haven't really had many shifts together. But a lot of my co-workers talk about Cole. Every time I have to bite back my talk and be like, don't fucking make that stupid ass cold joke you make online, Elio. No one is gonna find it funny. And it drives me insane. <laughs> like today I was on my break and I was like standing in the hallway because it was like three minutes before my break ended. So I didn't want to go to the break room because I just have to go right back down again. So I just stood there. And I was just looking at like the employee of the month cards and I saw Cole up there and like I, I took like a glance all around the fucking names in the hallway for like employee of the month and then I mumbled to myself like a fucking gremlin but where's Dylan? I hate myself! I hate myself! taste. That too is my favorite. Mr. Grimm, I've got a question. No need for formality. You can call me Grimm. Ask away. Can a ghost or reaper ever live again? No. Unless. Unless? They had a soul. But when you die, don't you lose your soul? I don't understand. Don't we have souls? No, I'm afraid you're all just spirits. There's a difference. When you die, your soul disintegrates because you don't need it anymore. Hmm. All that's left is a spirit, which makes you either a ghost or a reaper. I like that art. Every now and then, there are beings who arrive here with a soul completely intact. I'm guessing I'm one of those people because I still look human. Elio, I love that story. <laughs> I'm glad you like it twice. <laughs> Normally, when that happens, I redirect them back to life. This is a rare occurrence, however. Anyways, more oolong tea. Also, another thing about this Cole person was, uh, I was talking to, uh, one of my co-workers today, um, and I was talking about how, you know, I wanted to get a place, I wanted to find some place cheap in the areas so that I can take the bus to work and all that good stuff, and, uh, they mentioned that they lived in, like, this one apartment complex, and they're like, oh yeah, Cole lives there too, and, like, I, I was like, if I move there, if I move there, in the same apartment complex as this co-worker and Cole, I don't know if I can... I don't know if I can keep myself in check. Like, I can do it now, but like... What if, say, I lived next door to this Cole person? And they know me. They know I work at the job. They know me. And they start hearing me talking about Cole. And where's Dylan? Will they like think I'm obsessed with them or something for talking about Cole all the time? <laughs> That's the things I get scared about with people hearing me talk about stuff while I stream. Thanks. <laughs> oh, yes, please. I would like some tea. Nice. Do you have any more questions? It sounds like a summer anime plot. I moved into the apartment complex with someone that has the same first name as a joke I frequently make. And now I've been isekai And now I'm a VTuber. Do you have any more questions? Always wears Dylan, but what about how is Dylan? Oh my god, you quit that toy. <laughs> Good. Oh, there's a bunch of questions here. 
Why were you mad about balloons? Why shouldn't he be... Why wouldn't he not be mad about balloons? Are you a god? How did I die? What happens after I pass by? I'm good. Okay. I'm gonna choose this, but my answer is... It's good that he's mad about balloons. <laughs> you remember that? Well, I wanted to throw the party first. I was going to set up balloons in this room right here, but when I looked in the closet, all of the balloons were gone. Are you a god? No, I'm certainly not. As far as my powers go, I can teleport a certain distance. And I can reap ghosts very well, but other than that, I can't do a lot of things. I can't bake, for example. Such an amazing thing, food. I made a house in Minecraft, not the Bedrock server, but hey, built a thing. Oh? Oh, well, 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 well. Oh, did you share it on the Discord? Let me see. Oh, wait, no, that's ID. ID. Is ID still here? ID? I just saw what you posted on Discord. I just saw what you posted on Discord and that is a sin. That is a sin, ID. You had toast sandwich. ID left. Well, the next time I see ID, he is in trouble. They said it a while back. Oh God, he's a balloon setter, sinner. To hell with you. All people that let go of balloons go to hell. They go to, they go to double hell. How can you say no one will find it funny? That's comedy called. <laughs> I got one sec. They DM'd me that. <sighs> it's not even a toast sandwich. It's not even a toast sandwich. It's a toast, toast, toast. It's supposed to be two pieces of regular fucking sandwich bread with a toasted piece of bread in the middle. This ain't a toast sandwich. This is just a mistake. This is just a travesty, honestly. So hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. It's a toasted toast sandwich. I hate that. I hate that. How did I die? I died from looking at toasted toast sandwich. I don't know, I'm afraid. I don't see anything much happens on Earth. This ain't a toast sandwich, this is just a mistake. Ellie <laughs> laughing. That's just three pieces of toast on top of each other then. <laughs> exactly. So a mistake. What happens after I pass on? My guess is as good as yours. I've never seen the afterlife. Only delivered spirits do it. Okay. I'm good. You know, usually new reapers don't tend to believe any of this is real. If they do, they start assuming we're a cult. Hmm. I'm not sure why. Now, remember the first time I was basically asked what to call what turned out to be a toast sandwich? They said, the only thing I'm calling is the police. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Maybe it's the masks. That's what the point of the mask is. Uh... But it seems you've taken to the idea rather quickly. That's because I saw Timmy as a ghost. After that... And so, I feel rather concerned. Does he know? Oh my god, did my model just like, crash? Oh wait, no, I'm good. Never mind. It's just my stream monitor! <laughs> what are you trying to say? Simply whether you're alright, Lavender. Your modelio is still fine. <laughs> Thank you, Tori. <laughs> my modelio. Wait, would you call my mods Modelio too? Or are you calling if I get moderated, I would be Modelioed? Simply whether you're alright, Lavender. I care about all my Reapers, yourself included. I'm. I'm alright. Really? Mm. Wait, did I just get like a thing on my cheek? 
I see the modelino, finerino. <laughs> Your Barnes mod, Elio. Modelio. <laughs> oh, let me look at this. Ooh. Oh, wow. That is really pretty. Looks very nice and modern. It also looks kind of like a, like a skull head. I don't know if that was like the intention or not, but it looks really cool. And you got like... Is that a Sans reference, actually, by having the blue, f the blue flames inside the eyes? Yes, it's made of bone blocks. <laughs> if you were a model mod, you'd be a mod L E O. It is not a Sans reference. What is it a reference to then? It's blue flame inside of a skull's eyes. Very well. <laughs> a skeleton. Not all skeletons have blue eyes, Storm. <laughs> Relatedly. <laughs> oh. Baker, you didn't need to sneak into my closet for ingredients, you know. <laughs> but you looked busy, and I was running out of flour. How would you like teaching Lavender to read? Skeletons existed before Sans, and if you keep going down this path, I'm going to introduce you to yours! <laughs> Damn! I seem to have hit a sore spot. Or is that your funny bone? <laughs> I mean, I would like to help. But you know I don't fight Grim. You'd be better off asking someone else. You sure do like skeletons, huh, some dwarf? What do you think of this game with all the skeletons? You don't have to fight anymore. Well, what if they faint? You're the fastest person in the hollow next to me. You can run out of there carrying them. Well, okay. Excellent. Lavender. Whenever you're ready, talk to the baker at the bakery. I'm gonna go put away the ingredients. See you later, Lavender. All bones is good bones. <laughs> what about that one show, Bones? There's knitted fabric and a needle lying on the chair. I remember, I think I lived with someone that was a fan of the show, Bones. A mask, it looks incomplete. <gasps> Are they making my mask? Maybe. Make sure to finish your oolong tea before leaving. Very polite. Grim's teacup is empty. Strangely, you don't remember him drinking from it. Is that a goddamn Sans reference? <laughs> You're gonna make Dwarf angry! <laughs> is everything alright, Lavender? I hope the tea was to your taste. Grim's specialty is reaping ghosts. There's no way I can tell him about Timmy. Everything's fine. Thank you for the tea, Grim. My pleasure, Lavender. Did Lavender always have that swirly on their cheek? Ah, yes. And thank you for reminding me to lock the closet door, Lavender. What, you got a corpse in there? I do not enjoy scolding people. Aww. But I think they must be more firm about reapers wandering into my closet whenever they like. Damn, I can't see what he's got in his closet. Psst, sis, I need to talk to you. You peek into your hoodie pocket. What that guy said about having a soul? I had one too. Oh, I just not, okay. Lavender's got the little swirly and so does Timmy because they're brother and sister. Oh, But Timmy, everyone used to have that. No, but I had one when I arrived. Huh, so someone took your soul? What? I remember waking up in a cave and when I looked down, I looked like a person. Like I used to. And everything was kind of glowy, like a greenish glow. But then other ghosts came into the cave and they were scary and they started chasing me so I started running. 
Then I blacked out. When I woke up again, I felt light and I couldn't see myself. Sister, I hardly know why. <laughs> I think my soul is still here, Lavender. Somehow, I can feel it. Maybe that ghost took it. I believe you. I'll try to find it. Thanks, sis. Now, shh. I need to go. I'll look crazy if I'm caught talking to my pocket. You look crazy anyway. Oh, damn. Damn, Timmy coming out swinging. You stick out your tongue and immediately close your pocket. Aw. Day 127. The bunny has still not banned me. <laughs> Is Timmy me? <laughs> Timmy and Twy both start with a T. Hmm. The M in Timmy could be a W flipped upside down. And there's an I in Timmy. Is it really a sibling relationship if you don't come out swinging at that level every now and then? <laughs> it's always a competition with your sibling. You always gotta embarrass your sibling or make fun of them. You, got, you gotta get in their way somehow. <laughs> All right. I actually think here's a good place to end for the night. So let me just talk to Mr. Beaker. Yeah. Oh, hey, Lavender. I just finished shutting up to go. Are you ready? Okay, hey, to go. You do whatever you gotta do first. Okay. I guess we'll be going to go later. Oh, switch models. Okay, there we go. Hold on. I'm gonna show you my, my other model. My old one. Oh, God, I haven't configured this model for this program. <laughs> So we're gonna get those, those big old eyes. Oh uh, man, it's been a while since I used this model. This is nostalgic. It's Ellie Gold. Are you ending stream or changing games? I'm gonna be ending stream cause it's almost 11 and my uncle goes to sleep at 11. So I don't wanna, you know, be too annoying <laughs> and get kicked out. <laughs> Thank you guys again for coming for uh, Grimm's Hollow. I'm really enjoying this game. I know I suck at it, but it's cute. It's really cute. I might I might do some grinding off, off stream if it allows me to do that. <laughs> or should I, should I grind off stream? Maybe I shouldn't. I think this might be a short game. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. All the reapers <laughs> have ayaya energy. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you guys have a good night. Thanks for hosting the stream, Elio. Gotta go to keep watching the Mr. Rainer video. Good night. Oh, nice. Thank you for watching the Mr. Rainer video. And have a good night, everyone. Be sure to eat, drink, take your medication, and all that good stuff. And check my gamers. Good night. I can't wink on this model. Bye-bye. <laughs>